You have come to the late Jurassic period in search of the great and powerful Compsonathus. That's Compsonathus. It's very easy if you practice. Ow! Hey, Bavariosaurus! Did you hear what they're saying about me? I am the number one land predator in these islands in the depth of sea. It's true! No dinosaur gets past me. Why, well, see these legs? They are long and slender, which helps me to run very, very fast. You are so full of hot air. I'm surprised you don't float away. Do you dare insult me, the mighty Gomsonathus? I can eat any lizard, dinosaur, or fish I want. Any one. I was the first complete dinosaur fossil that scientists could study. You, you see? see? Again, Again, I was I first. Was first. Num -num Number one. one. Bring in the size chart. Okay, so I'm on the small side. So what? I'm still number one. Excuse me while I go and show our friend why I'm number one. Oh, you think I cannot climb? Well, you are wrong. My bones, they're hollow like a bird's, which means I'm light. And, oh yeah, see this tail? It'll help me stay balanced. You can run, but you can't hide because I am the magnificent Compsonathus! Oh, hi. I'm Corythosaurus. That's Cor, Rytho, Saurus. Do you know what that means? Helmet lizard. It's because of this thing on my head. My herd and I use them to make amazing sounds. Listen. <laughs> okay, that's not exactly what it's supposed to sound like. It must be all the dust from the volcanoes over there. <laughs> wow, what a sound. That's awesome. How come I can't make a big sound? Why can't I do it? Did you hear that? It's my herd calling. I'm gonna answer them if it's the last thing I do. What am I doing wrong? There's my herd. I wonder if they want to play with me. Hey guys, what do you say we play a game of... Whoa! Did you hear that? Did you? Oh joy! I wonder if they heard it. <laughs> Oops, sorry to wake you. I was just so excited that I finally made the same sound as you guys. I'll be quieter. Saurus, the frightful lizard. Did I scare you? Oh yeah, I'm the dino. Ah! Look at that scary dinosaur. Run for your life! That was a close one. Let me help you say my name. Das Pleto Saurus. Das Pleosaurus. Ah! 75 million years ago is a horror show of carnivorous monsters. But you're never going to find a another scarier than me. See these teeth? These are dagger sharp, curved, and they have the same edges as saw. See? Saw? Get it? Ha <laughs> ha! These teeth are huge. Uh, only smaller than my future cousin Tyrannosaurus Rex. But they're still big! Uh, like I said before, uh, my name means scary lizard. And there's nothing scarier than me. Uh, let's think of some scary animals. A lion is scary, all right. <laughs> what else? A great big grizzly bear. Those are totally scary. I'm telling you. It's my choppers as much as my size. 
Uh, I'm one frightful lizard, all right. I'm also hungry. Now that is scary. Hey there, come here. Closer, closer. Too close. Ah, that's better. My name is Dilophosaurus. That's Dilophosaurus. I live here in the early Jurassic period. That's 200 million years ago. Whoa, look at that. Two cicades. One, two. I love the number two. Dilophosaurus means two crested lizard. See, one, two. Two crests, ha! I'm a theropod. That means I run on two legs. Two. And it also means that I eat meat. Two dinners to go. Yum and yummier. Hmm. I live in what is now known as Arizona in the USA. I am the great, 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 great granddaddy of modern day birds. But I'm a lot bigger. In fact, I'm the biggest meat eater alive here in the Jurassic period. And here are my two favorite twos. My kids. What do you say we play two games of tag and find two snacks and pick two plants for mom? Great. See you tomorrow. Well, hello there. I've never seen you before. Looking around the late Jurassic forest, are we? Looking for a big dinosaur? Maybe like me? Well, you've come to the right place. I'm Diplodocus. Diplodocus. You found me. I'm kind of hard to miss, actually. Hmm, <laughs> I smell something yummy. Is it in here? Sigh. As you can see, I'm pretty big and it's hard for me to get into tight places, but that's why I have this really long neck. I love eating plants, all kinds of them. That's why they call me a herbivore. But being this big doesn't always make it easy. Hmm, how can I describe how big I am? Have you seen my herd? They're easy to spot. Imagine, they're all big like me. I've been looking for them all afternoon. It's like they've been hiding from me. You know what else comes in handy? My front legs. See how they're shorter than the back ones? Having these types of legs helps me keep my balance. Watch! I also have these cool peg-like teeth that grow forward. They help me strip all sorts of plants and swallow them whole. Mm, whatever that is, it smells so yummy. Hey, maybe that's my herd. Hey, what's the... Surprise! Yo, welcome to my forest here in the late Jurassic period over 150 million years ago. That's a super duper long time ago. My name is Dryosaurus. High five. It's pretty easy to say my name. Dryosaurus. It means oak lizard. This is a cheek tooth. Sort of shaped like an oak leaf, don't you think? I come from Tanzania. That's the problem with meat eaters like him. They're always trying to get to know me better. Personally, I like knowing trees and plants. You know, with a little sprig or two of fern. That's just yummy. I might be little, but I'm fast. How little? I'm three meters long. You probably noticed that I'm always running, but that's how I protect myself. Some dinosaurs have horns or really sharp teeth and claws, but I run really fast. And my tail helps me stay balanced when I make really sharp turns, like this. 
That's gonna leave a mark. Awesome turn you did there, dude. High tail. <laughs> On the down low. Hey. Oops, gotta go. Bye. <laughs> now that's fast food. Oh, where'd it go? Aha, found it. How's it going, eh? And welcome to the late Cretaceous period, 70 million years ago. I'm Edmontosaurus. That's Edmontosaurus, eh? I just found the puck so I can keep playing dino hockey with my pal, Eddie. Do you know where I got my name from? It's pretty cool. I was named after the city Edmonton, which is in what's now Alberta in Canada, where I'm from. Check it out, eh? My hands were made for pitching and catching. Eddie and I are practicing before the big game with the rest of our herd. Eh? Oh yeah, I'm the kind of dinosaur that can walk on two legs to get those really hard to reach leaves on trees. And four legs when I'm chasing Eddie. Do you see how long we are? As long as a sailboat. But we're pretty heavy, almost four tons. You're probably wondering how I could eat with a duck bill, eh? Well, I have up to 60 rows of teeth in my cheeks, eh? Our teeth allow us to eat the hardest seeds and conifer needles with no trouble at all. Ugh, I don't eat meat. Only plants go in this mouth. I better get back to practicing. Ugesaurus! Have a good one, eh? That's what I call fresh air on the open range. My name is Ineosaurus. That's i ne o -saurus. It means buffalo lizard. Did you know that I'm from what is now known as Montana? Only here, nowhere else in the world. You know, there's more to the late Cretaceous period than trees and stinky flowers. I'm a ceratopsid. That means I'm a herbivore. I eat plants. And I have a beak. And we have these big curved horns on our noses. Looks like a big bottle opener, doesn't it? Too bad there's no such thing as bottles in the late Cretaceous period. And I live in a big herd, which is great if there are any big dinos around that might be a threat. Just one of us might not be enough to scare off a big gobbler dino, even though we're six meters long and weigh two tons. But put us all together, and there is safety in numbers. And hey, if that doesn't work, there's always the old stampede! That's e ra fro -saurus. It means nimble, or lightweight lizard. Watch me. Hey, come over here. Over here. Yeah, this way. I'm in a race with a Brachiosaurus back there. Not that it's much of a contest. I'm one of the fastest dinosaurs around. Ooh, what a nice rock. I'm so fast I can even take time out and sun myself. I can tan faster than he can run. I have no worries. Ah, that's alive. Oh yes, I'm super fast. And that's got a lot to do with the way I'm built. You see, I'm a carnivore, so I eat meat. I'm perfectly built for chasing smaller animals out here in the plain. And how am I built, you ask? See, 
I'm long and lean. And these long legs may be perfect for running. And my tail helps me stay balanced when I turn. And I'm light. I weigh about 210 kilograms. Which is why I don't have to worry about... Hey! Where'd he go? I don't believe this. Brachiosaurus won. How could this be? I'm way faster than Brachiosaurus. Fine. I suppose if I had done less talking and more running, I would have won the race. Okay, you, get up! I challenge you to another race! Right, let's get on with it then. I am Eotyrannus, and this is the early Cretaceous period, over 130 million years ago. Oh, these two young sprouts here are juvenile Eotyrannuses. And fine young fellows they'll turn out to be, I can assure you. Today, I'm about to teach these fine young fellows how to hunt the mighty... Comsonathus. Yay! Eotyrannus fossils have been discovered in these parts of what is now Britain. It's where Comsonathuses are found as well. And Comsonathuses just happen to be our favorite meal. Isn't that right, chaps? Now, some of you may think that all members of the Tyrannosaur family are to be found in either Asia or North America. The fact is, we're all over the map. My name, Eo Tyrannus, means early tyrant lizard. Yes, we Tyrannosaurs are certainly the most ferocious carnivores. That means meat eater to have ever walked the face of the earth. Why? Eh? What's all that racket then? Where was I? Oh yes. Now. We Eotyrannuses are a bit smaller than our cousins, the Tyrannosaurus Rex. But we're just as skilled as the next chap when it comes to what we're really good at. Namely, hunting the mighty Comsonathus. And that's what we're going to do today, right chaps? Now the most important thing about hunting the mighty Comsonathus, keep your eyes and ears open at all times. Ready Sprouts? Let the Comsonathus hunt begin! Whew. Am I glad to see you! I thought you'd pass right by! I'm Eustreptospondylus. That's pronounced Eustreptospondylus. But you can call me Esther. This is my island, here in the Middle Jurassic period, nearly 160 million years ago. Pretty nice, huh? Eustreptospondylus means well-curved vertebrae, which are those bones in your back. As you can see, we are great dancers. Theropods like us are naturals. A theropod means two-legged dino, by the way. This makes us great at doing things on two legs, like running and dancing, and you can tell how much I love to dance. We're pretty long, about the size of a city bus. And we're four meters high at the hips. That's like how high you can jump up on a trampoline. Like most theropods, we have big teeth to eat with and two small arms, which makes it hard to clap, but perfect for playing the maracas. You know what time it is? That's right, limbo time! King. Only one thing to do now. Give the trophy to the best dancer around. And then, what else? Dance! 